series of dominoes fall. It's hard to see, but it is yeah. back in here. And then the series of dominoes fell and hit a ramp that released a roll of duct tape. And the roll of duct tape rolled onto um, a, a pulley system. Yeah. And then that released a car on the track. Right yeah. And then the car on the track uh, rolled down. Roll down and fell into a cup. Which released another pulley system at the top. That, that was here. And then uh, another marble. So I'm Janet Brownell. I teach physics at Waterford High School. And um, every year our physics classes participate in a Rube Goldberg competition. And the Rube Goldberg competition is a design and engineering competition. Where they have to build a machine that accomplishes a simple task in a complicated way. And so it ties into physics because eventually we will be talking about how the energy exchanges go from one to the next. Um, and how energy is transferred from one form, maybe kinetic energy, into potential energy or electric energy. Um, then it's a design competition because they have to incorporate theme and they have to incorporate um, steps into their theme. So if they have like a kitchen theme or a diner theme like our um, winning team did, they had an electric hand mixer and bar stools and dishware and things. Um, so. It's very much all about the new Common Core and the new next generation science standards because it, it requires engineering where they have to actually build something to solve a problem. And um, they have to work collaboratively in teams, which are some great life skills to learn how to work with others and work towards a deadline and accomplish a big task um, that seems impossible at first, but they're able to finally reach the end. So the first step of our project was to lift the needle up on this record player. Once the needle was lifted up, it would start to turn the record, and on the record we had a toy car that would go around the record and then eventually fall down this ramp. And going down the ramp, it hit a block that is right here, and what, this block would push this row of dominoes, and they would trigger this way, hitting this mouse trap. And attached to the mouse trap was a string and a stick, and the stick was holding up a wound up car. So once the mouse trap was triggered, it flipped and pulled the stick, releasing this car and hitting the block right here that would release this toy fire truck that would go this way, um, and triggering another mouse trap right here that was attached to a string attached to this record on this ramp. And once the mouse trap was triggered, it would pull the record player down this ramp. And as the record is falling down the ramp, it would pull the string through this pulley and it would pull a card out, releasing this ball that would fall into this basket in the corner. And as this basket was weighted down, it would lift up this cowbell up here that would offset this uh, teeter-totter, um, lowering this weight here and turning this pulley that had a stick on it that would push this toy car up and go down the ramp and hitting the spoon that acted as a lever, pushing the weight off the counter, flipping the switch on this electric hand mixer and turning on the mixer, spinning the attachment and erasing the chalkboard.